Hey, what, one of the things I want to do for you guys is pull back the curtain a little bit and give you guys a little glimpse into show business. And one of the things with show business is that it turns out that news is really what sells advertising on television. And so we want to give you a beautifully artistic show, but we also want to try to make money. So we decided <laughs> to assemble a Mystery Hour news team. And uh, we're going to run a little, try to tape a little promo here if you guys don't mind. Some of you guys might um, end up getting involved. I'm not sure how this is going to work, but uh, I think it'll be pretty fun. So here it is, the Mystery Hour news team. <laughs> All right, first stop for the Mystery Hour news team is indoor weatherman Ted Keller. Thank you. Thanks, Jeff. It's a real, uh, real forecast challenge. This is the kind of forecast I like. 72 right now indoors here in the beautiful Galois Theater. The high, 72, and the low was uh, 72. Back to you, Jeff. All right. All right, next up, we're going to head to Penelope. What's that with the investigative news department? Penelope. Thank you, Jeff. Uh, right now, we are going to investigate. Is your child's crib safe? Is that glass of water you're about to enjoy actually infested with tiny little death spiders? <laughs> we're here to crack open all the cases that will leave you unnecessarily terrified, such as, is my basement actually full of... Marshmallows. Marshmallows? <laughs> Are my grandparents, in fact, actually just... Lizards. Lizards. Who's to say, Jeff? Tune in at 10. Back to you, Jeff. All right. Thank you, Penelope. <laughs> Those guys answered so quickly that it's as if we gave them lines, but we didn't. <laughs> the guy was just waiting. Whatever they say, I'm saying marshmallows. <laughs> All right, next up, let's check in with Rachel Flutdorf with Celebrity Gossip. Rachel, what's happening? Hi, Jeff. We're here with all the really hard-hitting Springfield Celebrity Gossip. We're going to be talking to local celebrities such as Bats Pro's Johnny Morris, Mayor Bob Stevens, the HERS Building, and... Jordan. Jordan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bet you can't wait to hear. We're going to ask them all those really deep questions like, what are you... Scared of it. Scared of it, night. And who are you? Eating with. Eating with tomorrow. Everyone wants to know that. And finally, can I have some? Love. Love. Back to you, Jeff. Sir, stay away from our reporter. <laughs> All right, let's check back in with Ted Keller in the 10-day forecast. 10-day forecast. Now, pay attention here. I'll go slow. 10-day forecast, 72, and then trending toward, well, 72. And then about 10 days out, looks like it'll be 72. And uh, very little chance of rain. Back to you, Jeff. All right, very good, Ted. Next up. With politics, we have Thad Wranglebottom. Thad, what are you looking at? Thank you, Jeff. Uh, just to let you know, we'll be fighting for the little man uh, in our reports. Uh, just things like uh, Congress has earned their own nickname. Haggard. Haggard. <laughs> Congress is commonly called Haggard uh, now. Um, and, for instance, it's been reported that uh, members of Cong Congress typically earn an average of... 1450. <laughs> Jeff, we're not clear if that's $14.50. I think that's what it is. <laughs> it's typically how it's pronounced. Um, but it turns out most of them typically spend it on coffee. Coffee. Yes. <laughs> Haggard, 1450 coffee. Back to you, Jeff. All right. On to sports. Let's go to sports with Stet Brockton. Stet, 
Hey, Jeff. Well, it looks like Chiefs star quarterback Alex Smith will be sidelined to start this season. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alex injured his... Elbow. Elbow while doing something a little strange. He was... Playing dice. Playing dice. <laughs> so it looks like, once again, this year the Chiefs will... Rainbow. The Chiefs will rainbow. You heard it here first, folks. Back to you, Jeff. All right. Sounds like a miracle. All right, one last check of the weather, the 1,400-day forecast mm. with Ted Kelly. Yeah, confidence is real high. Um, I have to say, the confidence is really high on this forecast, 1,400 days. Uh, unless there's a huge mechanical issue, I think the high is going to be 72 for 1,400 days. Uh, I tell you what, though. I do think there might be a small chance, maybe a small chance of increased laughter, but honestly, this skit uh, it probably should have died a while back. Uh, back to you, Jeff. Thank you, Ted. We'll be right back with Rochelle Keeling. Stay where you are.